Hi everyone, first Muhammad Shah with you. Uh, our subject today, it's, uh, it is not a new subject. Uh, we encountered uh, this before. Uh, it's about Philippines Solar Collector. Uh, first of all, you have to uh, specify your folder from, uh, uh, don't open it from desktop. Go to your destination folder, sort by name and uh, group by type. Um, actually, this is a, a flapless oil collector in, in water working fluid. So I'm I'm going to show you how to uh, replace working fluids. Um, double clicking. Okay, this is our uh, main uh, flapless solar collector. Okay, and double clicking here, you will find your uh, inputs: uh, uh, solar radiation, uh, uh, losses parameters, coefficients, and so on. Uh, operating temperature and conditions. Okay, uh, uh, what I am going to do today is um, I am going to replace working fluid. This is a water working fluid. So first of all, I would like to save as. Um, uh, okay, save as. Let it be a uh, flapless solar collector. Uh, 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 butane. B U T. Okay, I am I am going to replace water by butane. So. This is uh, butane working flow and click saving. So uh, I'm going to the uh, MATLAB function. Uh, I will name this as butane, B U T, okay, B capital, capital, okay, saving, okay. Um, and I have to go here. This is not water, it's a butane, butane, okay. Butane, working fluid. Okay, so I'm going to my uh, folder, and this is butane working fluid. Double clicking here. This is my uh, my inputs. This is my uh, table data. This is liquid phase and vapor phase. I need just liquid phase. This is temperature, pressure, density, volume, uh, enthalpy, entropy, and so on. This is your uh, thermophysical properties. So we need to deal with uh, with these uh, properties. Okay, so uh, returning back to my uh, work, okay, working folder, saving, I'm going here, uh, I will name this by butane, butane, for example, okay, okay, uh, uh, what I, I, I should uh, swap, so I need enthalpy, uh, entropy, density and specific heat capacity so i'm going to uh, re uh, replace this uh, using uh, uh, lookup table so i am i have to replace enthalpy uh, for inlet and outlet okay so i have to go here and uh, it is a function of, of uh, temperature because my inputs are temperature so i have to uh, copy uh, copy this uh, this is temperature gradient okay and click copy Okay, returning back, double clicking, you will find the following. Breakpoints are your temperatures, so I have to uh, uh, remove this, click deleting, open uh, bracket, control V, and then uh, close your uh, brackets. Okay, now um, this, 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 uh, vector, this vector is uh, my temperature, so I need enthalpy. So I'll be here in F. So I will take this one. Okay. Control C or copy. And send it back here. Open bracket. Control V and uh, closing uh, my vector. So hit apply. Okay. You will. This is your uh, uh, change occurred here and uh, had occurred in my uh, lookup table. So I need the same for entropy. I will go for entropy uh, column here. Yes, this is G entropy. So I I will copy it. Okay. Copy Control C. Okay. Return back again. Okay. This is uh, my entropy table. That is your uh, entropy control uh, or your outputs. And now I need the temperature again. I will do this uh, four times in order to swap my uh, my table data. Okay, go to the temperature, control V and closing, hit apply. Okay, so this uh, this is my entropy. Let's go for uh, density. 
let's go for temperature again control V this is my temperature and uh, let's go for uh, heat capacity this is my temperature again control V and closing bracket okay so let's go for uh, I'm sorry we have here density uh, okay density and specific heat capacity let's go for density first let's go for density it's here yes I will copy this column we show that all column and vector are the same dimension okay and open control V and closing this is my density and hit OK and let's go for uh, specific heat capacity I think it's here yes this column copy control C and let's go here specific heat capacity to be sure okay open control V and we have to close our bracket so uh, we we prepared our uh, model in order to be run under butane uh, um, uh, heat properties so let's go for uh, temperature gradients and the solar radiation suppose it's 800 when the speed it's about 2 uh, 2 and ambient temperature and let's solar field temperature be sure that um, let's go for L temperature it's about uh, 1.8 1.8 degrees Celsius let it be uh, uh, 1 degrees Celsius or 2 degrees Celsius okay I have to change uh, L condition let it be 5 degrees Celsius and output should be because the pressure is massive because this is butane uh, at 50 degrees Celsius as you can see here 50 degrees Celsius it's about uh, about five bars that's quite uh, uh, overwhelming on uh, on the solar field okay hit okay and saving okay and hit apply and we will see uh, our results and you can uh, uh, change in dynamic mode if you would like uh, okay this is our results okay as you can see collector area and uh, let's hit uh, infinity and it changes simulation time into infinity and let's go here and double clicking and trying to uh, make some changes and uh, hit up hit run and let's let's try to change okay uh, i will change um, outlet temperature let's let it be up to so I have to wait okay up to uh, 50 uh, 56 70 60 degrees Celsius okay and let's reduce the volume okay volume of tank volume or load I'm reducing the, the volume okay and let's increase a little temperature let's increase okay that's enough it's just an example okay okay as you can see here you realize that the changes in uh, implicit temperature and uh, uh, thermal loads fin efficiency of uh, flow factor and so on suppose I need to uh, change the limitation because the temperature no more than uh, 149 degrees Celsius but uh, be sure that uh, the flap plate collector it is not going to to be operated over 120 110 100 uh, no more than this but uh, in case you would like to change your uh, 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 limitations just click here control M okay and going here and going to uh, outlet to solar field temperature and you can uh, choose you can uh, make it 140 degrees Celsius this is a maximum and your minimum is 25 and you can click OK apply saving if you are clicking here you will find it change your limitation uh, as well uh, finally I would like to thank you very much for your interest in our model don't forget to uh, like share uh, and subscribe uh, thank you very much